Ayun, no, konti lang. Kasi yung tatlong table lang. <laughs> Joke lang. Thank you so much, uh, Miss Lerma. Anyway, that's uh, uh, the song for the dot and CMR or the customer complaints. January to May, so we will continue monitoring June to December. That ops plan namin to ng operations. So next topic na tayo, ayan na yung top 5. So hindi ko na masyadong ititalyo for you to see yung standing ng branch nyo when it comes to complaints and tests nandiyan ang rank 1 if you follow hanggang rank 4 actually may sinod pa yan ayan pa basically minimal lang naman siya no? since we're talking about January to May but then syempre uh, even though wala nang tinatawag na zero pest but then let us continue improving para mabawasan natin yung customer complaint na no? pest for Corey Mater, Natay, um, Benitez at Molino. Where's Benitez? Basically, what pass? Yung karaniwan ng complaints sa uh, Benitez and why? And ano yung recommendation? Sir, um, yung, uh, yung nangyari kasi dyan, sir, yung mga broccoli, sir. Um, yung pinaka mga hugo niya, sir, natin mismo flower, so hindi nila na-monitor. Fresh and then, broccoli. Since standalone po yung store ko, uh, medyo marami lang ako may time na nadapuhin yung pagkain ng customer. So, Thank you. Where's uh, Molina? Molina? Hindi ko sabihin, mo. Molina? Nandito po ba? Wala. Anyway, since isa siya sa pinakabago nating branch, so medyo alarming na siya yung number one then. When it comes to, when it comes to complaints on and on for a month. So again, ayan pa yung ibang branches. Hindi na natin isa-isa. And just for you to see, and realize and improve. And sa food phase naman, number one ang heads of bow. Where's heads of bow? What's the problem? What do you think? Bagong stuff. Inconsistent. Ang compliance sa ating standard. So ano dapat ang recommendation? It's your body. And of course, training. Importante. Importante training sa bagong empleyado. And even sa mga datihan, ha, continuous training dapat tayo. Complaints on food quality and presentation. Number one, MOP. With 30 complaints. First, MOP. Come on. Hindi nakaparap ka na yung answer sa amin sa food quality yung lati yung chicken. Ayun, tapos i-delivery na lang namin yung mga staff din. Nais ko din po yung sa mga, mismo din po yung mga head, tinausap ko rin. Kung kung dapat proper sa procedure sa bago. Para pag-iludo ng chicken. So, we're hoping for improvement. Since yeah. nagkaroon na ng training, yung mga staff. Yes sir, may, may improvement na siya ng sir last month. Very good. Okay, we'll get to the next. Top 5 complaints on customer service. With 37 complaints, Aslex got it. Rank number 1. Where's Aslex? Come on, complaints. Why? Kasi yung ibang mga customer na, namin dun sir na regular, like uh, around San Palo, Manila, which is dapat sakop na ng Bigibara. Sa Dumay? Apo, Bigibara. Eh, sab, sabi, sabi ng customer, sabi daw talaga niya gustong mag-order. Mag sabi niya, hindi ko alam kung anong meron sa ano po, Bigibara. Yun. Hindi, hindi ganun po ano. Hindi, yun kasi talaga yung sinabi ng guest po sir. Kasi sabi, is... Yun nga, sabi ng rider ko po, uh, out of grid area na nga po namin. 
Ibig sabihin, sa piggy bar na nga po siya. Ngayon, sabi niya, hindi, ayoko doon. Gusto ko sa inyo. Deliveran niyo ako ngayon na. Ganun. Parang ganun yung... So, are you saying there's a need to improve the, you know, the grid? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Pero... Oh, yun nga sir. Oh, pero according to rider ko nga po sir, yun nga po, medyo... How frequent? Ay, selected ba yan o lagi? Palagi. Yung regular guest namin sir, palagi naman yung nag-order. Every night, every night naman po yun sir. Okay, there's a need also to improve yung communication, coordination, explanation. Opo. Okay. Then to understand. Opo, yun naman po. Well, bali kapag may mga ganung okay. ano sir, yung kahera ko, pinapatawag ko na lang doon sa mismong guest, yung mga may... Magpapadjust na lang kami ng oras dun sa yung parang malilit na yun. Very good. I'm sure na-experience nyo rin yan, ha? Yes, sir. So, what is important is um, we need to improve para yung ating customer complaints mas bumaba pa. Kasi may target tayo for the whole year. Okay? Deliveries, I am talent. See your brands. Salaries, uh, tap and fill villages. Very minimal lang, ha? So, kuha na tayo sa sample MOP. MOP, ano yung example na yan? Miss Dara, Dara, Travel or Field Parade? Pink Packeting, sir. Pink Packeting. So, that's 10. Yes, sir. Okay, because we don't force. Travel is a big force, di ba? Thank you. And accident occurrence, Thomas Morato Alareta at number one, with dating accident occurrence minor or major from January to May. Where's Thomas Morato? Hmm? Why? What happened? And what are the improvements? Come on. So yun na po yan, yung mga nauuntog dun sa may
may uh, siguro sa ibang branch okay but then may mga branches ah uh, maybe nagtatrabaho lang sila then walang usapan walang feedback walang reporting masyado maybe dahil madaling araw baka kuyat na pagod na then evaluation letter sa mga pest control ng other ad, other admin ako na before kasi ako na request sa inyo na nagagawa ng letters sa admin anyway gumawa na ako ng draft sa send ko na lang sa inyo Ito yung mga pest control na pagsak ang evaluation sa ad, sa mall. Hindi under CDR, hindi under PASCAL, hindi under PRULIN o alay. So mamaya isi-send ko na sa inyo. Plan ko nga lang ha. Lalagay nyo lang ano. Pero kung pasado naman yung evaluation, no need for a letter ha. Ang recommendation ng mall manager, pwede daw tayo magdagdag ng pest control sa inyo. Dagdag? Hindi replacement. Kasi parang wala siyang action eh. Kasi pag dagdag, I assume it will be additional cost. Nagiging double yung cost natin sa test control. Ang recommendation kasi natin is kung hindi talaga effective, despite of the preventive actions na ginagawa ng nila test control, we are recommending for a replacement ng test control na accredited naman natin or under us. Yun yung nire-request sana natin. Okay, but then, sa mga, ad, sa mga malls na pasado naman yung evaluation, no problem. As long as tama yung evaluation, ha? So that's for evaluation. And another concern, uh, nagkaroon kami ng agreement about the seminar and training. So magsasubmit sila ng course outline. Sila magpapuntak ng seminar and training on integrated pest management program. Tentative schedule is July 24, 2 to 3 hours lang to. At kayo'y magiging participants and the kitchen heads. So sandali na to ha. So I, I hope wala problema yung schedule July 24. So kasama dito yung pest identification, familiarization sa mga iba-ibang klase ng pest, yung behavior ng mga hippies, mga langap, ng mga rodents, and bugs, Yung mga products and chemicals at methods and procedures, ipapaliwanag sa inyo. Uh, Magpagdadala rin sila ng samples. During our meeting with the pest control provider, nagbigay sila ng sample. At kinain nila sa harap namin. Because that's food grade. So ang ginawa namin, kumain din kami. At masarap siya. <laughs> Pero syempre, ano lang yun. Just to, ano lang, to try and taste na food grade talaga siya. Then, pag-aaralan din natin at pag-uusapan during the seminar in SOP, ano yung mga do's and don'ts before, during, and after treatment. Medyo nagkakaroon ng problema. Any question? So far? Good. Uh, so, parang mag-uusap kami, enough na nga daw yung binigay natin yung contract, di ba? Pero according to them, wala pa naman daw accredited pest control ang Paranaque. Kaya they accepted the contract. According to them. Anyway, tayo naman, since naibigay na satisfy na natin yung kailangan nila requirements, so, wala na tayong problem. But then, I don't know, ibang cities kung ganun din yung magiging uh, situation. Oh, this one is the update lang sa DR, January 28. So, kaya ko na pinapresent dahil yung hindi sa akin ito na Exico. Um, this is from HRB. So, just see your branch. So, nandiyan naman na kung anong pinakamarami so far. Kung ilan yung nabigyan ng 3 days suspension, 6 days suspension, meron ding 9, day, nine days. And basically, pinakamarami sila, warning. And the total for all the branches na nabigyan ng DR. And we're talking of audit findings, DR, during audit ng branch ng TST assistant. So wala, hindi to sa operations, hindi ito sa Pinas, more on audit ng branch. And lastly, reminders and call for health, ayaw po yung schedule ng next GMP and food safety seminar for the service crew for the third batch it will be uh, July 17th full day I will send an email about this it's a staff fourth batch yung mga hindi nakatend that July 19th naman Thursday seminar work on IPM July 24th Tuesday 9 to 12
well, eh, alam kayo yun na ha. So, pa-approve ako pa rin din kay Sir Nico, wala pa mag-click sa schedule. Since maabilis lang naman yung seminar ng uh, uh, IPM, I also recommend na i-iwan yung mga lahat ng PCO at safety officers, mag-meeting tayo after lunch. Para hitting two birds with one day, <laughs> with one stone. Okay sa inyo yan? Ha? Ano? Wala sumagot? Okay sa inyo yung schedule? Ano yung magagawa? Kasi magkakaroon tayo ng meeting for safety officers. Attention! Yung sabihin nyo ng doll, dole, wire, or work, accident, incident, report. Eh, at least ma, medyo nirequest lang sa amin. Lahat pa ng branches dito, meron tayong electrical and mechanical permits. Taas nga kamay yung meron. Isa, dalawa, tatlo, apat. Mechanical and electrical permits. Electrical lang. Tatlo lang. So, lahat is lahat pala wala. So, I'm gonna inform the EPSCAM about this, plus engineering. So, basically, we're talking kanina about customer complaints. So, ito yung pumapatay sa negosyo ng uh, negosyo natin sa restaurant and hindi ito gusto ng bawat isa, especially ng management. Galit sila para dito sa customer complaint. Galit din dapat tayo pag maraming customer complaints. But be grateful, sabi nga sa seminar natin, pasalamatan natin sila na nagpa-complain. Dahil nga ito tayong opportunity to make them happy again. Do you agree? 